You ever wish you healed as quickly as you did when you were younger? Yeah, me too. Speaking of which, when you're constantly fighting for your life against powerful or mystical beings, the ability to bounce back quickly is vital to your survival. This is Top 10 Nerd, and today we are looking at some of the most powerful healing factors in comics. This list is not ranked in any particular order and is by no means comprehensive, so make sure to mention more healing characters in the comics if you want to see them included in a possible part two of this video. Now that that bit of housekeeping is out of the way, let's get started. Number 10, Shazam. When a child named Billy Batson was given powers by a mystical wizard, he gained the ability to transform into the mighty hero Captain Marvel. After a lengthy court process, he instead gained the ability to transform into the hero Shazam. Shazam has the wisdom of Solomon, the strength of Hercules, the stamina of Atlas, the power of Zeus, the courage of Achilles, and the speed of Mercury. Take the first letter of all those heroes' names and put them together, and you get Shazam. Although this has granted Billy an impressive grab bag of powers, we are going to focus on the power of Zeus, which lets him control lightning and is the source of his healing powers. When either Billy or Shazam are injured, he can call down lightning to magically heal him of all his wounds. The most extreme example of this that I could find was when Shazam was hit by a tesseract bomb, which turned him inside out. Although the agony was understandably intense, a single bolt of lightning got the hero back in fighting shape almost immediately. Number 9. Solomon Grundy. Although there are some variations on the details of his origins, we do know some things about Solomon Grundy's past. He was a 19th century man named Cyrus Gold who, for one reason or another, was killed and disposed of in Slaughter Swamp. The swamp, either through some crazy science or magic, depending on the version, resurrected Cyrus as the undead Solomon Grundy. Grundy has very limited intelligence but this is made up for by his incredible strength and amazing resilience. He has been shown to be able to reattach severed limbs in mere seconds, and even when he is defeated and seemingly killed, it is never long before this gray creature is resurrected and terrorizing the people of Gotham City. Number 8. Wolverine. Perhaps the hero on this list most known for his healing, James Howlett began life in 19th century Canada, where he lived until his bestial mutant powers appeared, and he was forced to leave his life behind and wander the world adopting the name Logan. His healing factor has also prevented him from aging, allowing him to live for hundreds of years. He was eventually the test subject of the Weapon X program, where he received his adamantium claws and skeleton. He briefly joined the Canadian government's Department H program, taking on the identity of Wolverine before eventually joining the X-Men. Wolverine has survived massive amounts of physical damage, such as being ripped in two by the Hulk, having his metal skeleton torn out by Magneto, and being caught in an atomic explosion, usually managing to heal himself in a matter of minutes. Although his healing factor is powerful, Logan can be killed by drowning, and has a weakness to an alloy called carbonadium which slows down his healing factor. He is also vulnerable to the Muramasa Blade, a katana forged out of part of Wolverine's soul. Number 7. Superman This is one of the Man of Steel's lesser known abilities, because it's so hard to hurt him in the first place. Although someone with only a passing familiarity with Superman might think that he can only be hurt by kryptonite, Superman has been injured many times in battle, and usually manages to bounce back. A big part of this is due to him being powered by the sun's yellow solar radiation. So so if he gets caught in a nuclear explosion and is horrifically injured, as he was in The Dark Knight Returns, absorbing solar energy can help him heal his injuries. He has also demonstrated this ability when his throat was slashed by Wonder Woman's tiara. Although this definitely hurt, the wound healed quickly, with Superman being able to speak again only a few panels later. As they are also Kryptonian, we can assume that this ability is also shared by other DC characters such as Supergirl and General Zod. Number 6. Deadpool when the mercenary Wade Wilson was diagnosed with terminal cancer, he joined the Weapon X program where he underwent experiments with the goal of curing his illness and granting him mutant powers. He was given a powerful healing factor, However, it also caused the cancer cells in his body to go wild and left him horrifically disfigured. Deadpool goes through a huge amount of damage in the comics, regularly walking off gunshot and stab wounds and regrowing lost limbs. This ability is so powerful that when he found a freezer full of his severed limbs being kept by the obsessed Ella Whitby and he threw them in a dumpster, the limbs used their healing abilities to fuse together and create a second, more evil Deadpool. Number 5. The Flash 
Flash. Okay, I'm gonna hand this entry to our resident Flash expert, Connor Meek. You can see him as one of the hosts of our sister YouTube channel, Most Amazing Top 10. But being that he is obsessed with the Scarlet Speedster, we figured this would be a good time to do a little cross promotion. Hey, what's going on? Thanks for having me, Andrew. When Barry Allen was in his lab working with dangerous chemicals, he was struck by lightning and doused by the chemicals. We later found out that he was actually the bolt of lightning that hit himself, but that's not important right now. The accident gave him access to the speed force, a cosmic representation of motion that pushes both time and space forward. The speed force grants Barry his super speed, as well as his heightened metabolism. This heightened metabolism makes the Flash constantly hungry, but also gives him the ability to heal his wounds at a much faster rate than a normal person. So while you or I might get injured and need a few weeks or months to heal, the Flash can heal the same wound in a matter of hours. Wow, that really is amazing. Now get out of here. Number four, the Hulk. When scientist Bruce Banner was about to test a gamma bomb, he realized that a young man named Rick Jones had found his way onto the testing ground and was about to be caught in the blast. Banner raced to save the young man and helped him reach safety, but was caught in the blast of the gamma bomb himself. Due to a genetic mutation in his DNA, rather than dying, this unlocked the power to transform him into the Incredible Hulk whenever Bruce became angry or outraged. The Hulk has nearly limitless strength and is one of the most powerful creatures on Earth, but he also has an extremely powerful healing factor. A great example of this is in Incredible Hulk number 398, when the villain Vector shreds Hulk's skin off his body with a blast from his powers. Hulk is clearly in pain, but in a matter of moments is able to heal from the blast. So he can't get a solo movie, but other than that, he's pretty much unkillable. Number three, Wonder Woman. The daughter of Zeus and Hippolyta, the queen of the Amazons, this princess of Themyscira left her secluded island to become a messenger for peace before eventually joining the Justice League and becoming one of Earth's most powerful heroes. As well as her magical lasso of truth, tiara, and bracelets of submission, Wonder Woman also has an impressive grab bag of powers, including super strength, speed, and flight. In addition to this, she also has accelerated healing, which allows her to heal from injuries in a matter of moments. Due to a gift from Demeter, she also has the ability to merge with the Earth to instantly heal should the injuries be too much for her normal healing powers to handle. Number two, Madcap. All 40 passengers were killed, with the exception of the man who would become known as Madcap. Although he survived, he lost his mind, not understanding why he should be spared. He tried to throw himself in front of a car, but emerged unhurt. This destroyed what was left of his sanity, and he became Madcap. He went through New York driving people insane and putting them in danger, not understanding that unlike him, they could be hurt. He eventually got in an argument with Deadpool about whose healing factor was more powerful. They were burnt to dust by Thor's lightning, and though Deadpool survived, and though Deadpool survived, Madcap lived on in DP's mind before eventually regenerating himself. He has survived several disintegrations over the years, and Deadpool eventually did admit that Madcap was the more powerful healer. Number one. Elixir. Josh Foley was a normal boy, albeit a bully who joined a mutant hate group called the Reavers, until he was injured at one of the meetings by a Reaver with a blade arm named Donald Pierce. Josh's arm was cut, but he was amazed when the cut instantly healed itself. Although he tried to deny the mutant side of him, he eventually discovered that he had the power of biokinesis, which allows him to alter the biological structure of both his and other people's bodies. He went on to join the X-Men and became an Omega-level mutant. Unlike the others on this list, Elixir is not limited to healing himself and has used his powers to heal dozens of people people at a time. As if that was not impressive enough, he also has the ability to return himself and other people from the dead. This ability was pushed to its limit when he affected all 16 million dead mutants on the island of Genosha in Uncanny X-Men Annual, Volume 4, Number 2. That's our list. What other characters have incredible healing factors? Let us know in the comments below and make sure to like and subscribe for more Top 10 Nerd.